morning everyone today is a big day little mermaid is coming out you guys know i'm just like so excited for this movie like literally hallie is like the most perfect human on the planet i just want to do a little mermaid themed vlog today one of the things that i'm gonna do is i'm gonna dye my hair red today i've been wanting to dye my hair like a crazy color for like the past five years i've been wanting to do like a pink or a purple being in my 20s like that's like the perfect time to do it but i just a little chicken nugget i've been too scared to like actually commit to anything like that february or march i was like I'm gonna dye my hair red. I wasn't super convinced that I was gonna do it. I think it's hard to know if something's gonna look good on you. Then, Shay Mitchell posted this photo and she convinced me. That's exactly what I wanted because I feel like we have similar skin tones. I showed her the photo the last time I got my hair done and she was like, okay, yeah, like let's do it. Let's totally do it and I am so excited. I'm nervous. I'm nervous because I've never dyed my hair this color. At least it's not like a bright red. I think if it was bright red, like I would actually be terrified, but it's more of like a muted, it almost looks brown. There's gonna be a couple other things that we're gonna do this week um, to kind of celebrate the Little Mermaid. Let me know in the comments if you've ever dyed your hair like a crazy color, like red is the craziest. I feel like it's not even crazy because I feel like a lot of people naturally have like red hair. Remember in middle school, girls would get like pink highlights like underneath and like it was so cute. Like I always thought it was so fun. I was like, oh my God, like, I want to do that. But like I'm literally a chicken baguette. Anyways, I'm going to continue getting ready. I want to try and hurry up, maybe leave in the next five minutes so I can try and get a start. <laughs> Literally dead. No, it looks good. A literal mermaid. No, literally. She's a mermaid. What does it look like on the camera? Okay, now it's gonna be real red. You guys, <laughs> like, what is happening? <laughs> this is so crazy. She is the little mermaid. She literally is. Whoa. Wow. I love it. You know, I met you in this, your hair was this length. Really? Yeah, and then you cut it to and like I here. Can, yeah. So it's grown. Yeah. That much. It's growing. Oh my god. She needs to watch it. Just finished getting my hair done and I ate some lunch. Like, you guys, my hair is literally red. Like, what is happening? So, the next part of today's adventure is we're gonna go and get our nails done. I wanna see if they can do chrome. So, I'm gonna do some chrome nails. And hopefully, it can look like seashells or something. home now here's what it looks like okay I love it now that I'm looking at it a little bit more I think it definitely took some getting used to when I first saw it like literally when I was in the chair and she was like blow drying it and I was just so nervous like my heart was racing I'm so scared I never do color like I said I've always done natural colors and this is my first like crazy color I feel like red is not even that crazy but to me it's crazy what do you guys think 
let me know. I feel like it looks pretty good. I now have some special shampoo and conditioner. This is the Avita Color Control Shampoo and Conditioner. I don't know if you can see. This is what it looks like. So I need to start using this. Also, like the top, like you can kind of see like a red kind of coming down on my skin. She said that the first couple of days I should sleep on like a black pillowcase because um, it does like come out while you're sleeping a little bit. I need to go to Target tonight and pick up like a black pillowcase. I got my nails done. I feel like they're a little crooked. Not the nail itself, like the little pearls. Where I get my hair done is with Gianna, which you guys know Gianna, but Gianna works at Spoken Wheel. They are located in Palo Alto, but they have other locations as well. I believe their other location is New York. I don't know if they have any others besides those two, but definitely look into it, see if they're in a city near you. Definitely check them out, and of course, if you are in the Bay Area, check out Miss Gianna, because every time Gianna does my hair, I'm obsessed. Like, she just does such a great job, and I love it. My hair is definitely, like, brighter in the sun. Obviously, like, when you're not in the sun, I feel like it's not as vibrant which I like. I didn't want like super bright red hair. It's not as vibrant, but it's still super cute. I love it. I'm gonna stop vlogging for today. I'll pick up the vlog in a couple of days because we have a Little Mermaid photo shoot. I am so excited. Um, that's like the whole point of me. Well, it's not the whole point of me dyeing my hair, but because I dyed my hair, I was like, I need to do like a really good photo shoot. I am so excited to do it. I'll show you guys what the shoot is because I've been so excited for it. I can't believe I have red hair. Like, what the heck? It is the next day. I was gonna wait until the photo shoot to continue this vlog, but I figured we could do a Little Mermaid haul because I have a bunch of packages to share with you guys that I've been literally, like, I think I bought these items from Amazon in March. Like, it's been a while and I have not opened them because I've had this video in my mind. Start off with some, like, random little things that I got. Actually, today I got to this in the mail. It's a package from Black Girl Sunscreen, which I've never heard of this brand before they reached out to me. And I'm so excited. Look at this packaging, first of all. I'm like, I need to keep this box forever. I don't know what I'm gonna do with it, but it's beautiful. They have this Little Mermaid um, sunscreen. It's moisturizing sunscreen lotion. This is sunscreen gel for your face. This video is not sponsored. They just wanted to send it over, but if you guys want to check it out, you guys can get it at Ulta, actually. So random things. The first thing is this phone case. Now you're like, why is this Little Mermaid theme? Well, I have this pop socket. This is from Castle Crystals, and they sent this to me a while ago, and it's a seashell, like, Little Mermaid-themed pop socket with all the gems. Like, how beautiful. And I've been wanting to put this on a case. Found this on Amazon. It was, like, 10 bucks. Like, okay, kind of perfect. I do wish it was more just, like, white instead of, like, the blues that are in here, the blues and the pinks, but it's okay. I'm excited to add this to my phone, but I'm so excited. So pretty. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. And now I can just use this. Wait, is it centered? I don't know if it's centered. I can't tell. It looks centered. But it also looks like it's kind of off to the side. Oh, I think if I keep staring at it, it's going to drive me crazy. Hopefully it's a protective case. I don't know. I feel like if it was $10, it might not be that protective. Oh my gosh, look at her. It looks so cute with my nails. I'm obsessed. This is like literally perfection. Oh my gosh, I feel like an actual mermaid. I'm a mermaid. I am Ariel. I last like random little thing I want to show you before I unbox like the actual um, merch. Bought these little starfish to put in my hair for the photo shoot tomorrow. Here are the little ones. So sad because the one of the big ones broke. At least we do have another big one, so I need to be really careful with it. Can't wait to wear them to the photo shoot, and then I'm also gonna wear them with my blue dress for the uh, premiere thing. Now it's time to open up. The big ones. The most important thing that I purchased and I've been waiting to freaking open is this lounge fly. You guys know I'm a lounge fly girl. I needed it. I just simply needed it in my collection. It's so beautiful and it's even more beautiful in person. I don't know if you can tell, but she's like kind of glittery. And then we have the pearl details. Like the pearls is like really getting me. This is also like iridescent. So are the straps, which is so beautiful. We have the little quote in the back which is really cute i'm obsessed 
obsessed with this launch play, you guys. There is a dingle hopper on the side, which I love the little detail. On the inside, we have this kind of pattern, like little little tropical vibes love it so much it is so perfect in every single way still need the matching wallet it was out of stock when i placed that order so i didn't get it but i do need the matching wallet i also bought children's book because i'm a child it's called make a splash book um i'll probably give this to my sister i just wanted to buy it because i had to show my support for hallie so i bought it and it has like really pretty photos on the inside actually so like are you kidding me i'm so excited for this so cute. Okay. Also bought the classic Little Mermaid. Like, we love both mermaids here, okay? But I wanted the classic one, and Amazon has a bunch of these books. Like, I love the artwork. They have, like, Frozen, Beauty and the Beast, Snow White, like, literally every single princess. I kind of want to collect them all, because, you know, you know, if I buy one, I need all of them. Picked up the Ariel one. Um, you already know I need the Tiana one for sure. I have not one, not two, but three Little Mermaid dolls. Why did I buy them all? Originally, I was just gonna buy one for myself just to like have the collector's item and then the more I thought about it I was like, maybe I should get one for my sister. Maybe I should get one for my niece So I bought multiple we'll see who I end up giving them to what I end up doing with them But I mean you can never have enough black aerials in your life like how beautiful it's so iconic they did so much merch for this movie because I, I Love her as Ariel. I'm so excited That's basically it for my Little Mermaid haul, but we will continue this vlog tomorrow for the photo shoot. So excited to bring you guys along. Let me know if you guys have bought anything from the Little Mermaid collection because we need to support Hallie. Hello, hello, hello. It is a photo shoot day. So I did my makeup. I did a little TikTok get ready with me. So if you guys want to watch that, it's on my TikTok. I'll show you what I did for my eyes. I used this ColourPop Shell Shocked Pressed Powder Palette. This shade right here, it's like kind of dirty because I used my finger that had like foundation on it. This is the shade that I used to get like the blue color and I think it's so pretty. I just ate lunch so my lip gloss came off. It's like the matching lip gloss. There's two of them. So this one's my goodies and this one's more of like a pink color I believe. Yeah. There's like the pink one. Um, this one is in the shade Beach Please. There's like more of the blue. Also, my allergies today have not been the vibe and they need to calm down because today out of all days, like I just don't need allergies today. I did take allergy pills and it's just not really working right now. So I feel like I sound congested because I've just been sneezing for like the past two or three hours. I want to try on my dress. Still haven't tried it on yet and it needs to work. It needs to be perfect because if not... I don't have a choice like it literally has to work the original dress that i wanted is from windsor but by the time i went to go place the order it's still not in my size i should have remembered that it's prom season so it wasn't gonna be in stock I ended up going on shein and finding something and i didn't even realize that i ordered two accidentally i'm just gonna hope like is it good quality no <laughs> It's not. I definitely would have preferred the Windsor one, but I mean, at least this one's cheaper. Part of me is scared that it's going to be see-through, and the straps are definitely interesting. But it literally has, like, the slit, and it has, like, kind of, like, the slouchy at the top, so it's, like, kind of perfect. It just needs to look good, so I'm going to try it on. I still haven't done my hair yet, but I just really want to try this dress on. You guys, stop. I'm going to start crying. Oh, my God. Here's the dress. Are you freaking kidding me right now? Guys, my little $10 dress worked and my red hair and my makeup. Stop. I'm literally Ariel. Shut up. You got Shut up. I literally am a mermaid. I'm a mermaid with human legs. Okay, Shein, come through with the $10 dress. I was really scared it wasn't going to work. I do need to figure out what I'm going to do with my bra, but it's so cute. I'm thinking we could do these earrings. So cute. Okay, I want to see what the starfish look like. Man, it looks like I'm five years old. I'm going to have to play with this once my hair is done. Maybe it should go like that or something. That's pretty. And then I can put, like, the other ones. Y'all, I'm a freaking mermaid this is like gonna be my favorite photos to ever exist i might print these out and hang them up in my room because queen 
I love it. <laughs> I received a PR package, which is Little Mermaid themed, so it's like fitting for today's video. And I already opened it because I was too excited, but like look at this artwork. I die. Look at the inside. This is from Pacifica Beauty. First thing we have is this reusable eye mask. Set it to try it out. There's also this Seafoam Complete Face Wash, which removes your makeup, cleanses, and tones. I probably won't use this just because you guys know I have sensitive skin. I probably wouldn't end up using it. Maybe I'll try it once just to see if it removes my makeup, but... Yeah, I don't know. I get nervous about skincare like that. Is a vitamin serum, vitamin C, and marine extracts. Maybe I'll try this, like a little oil thing. I don't know. I like the idea of using the drops. <laughs> I've never had anything like that, so I want to try that. A matte setting mist. I would put it on today, but my makeup cannot be ruined today, and if it doesn't work... I'm not trying to like ruin my makeup today. <laughs> Definitely want to try out the setting mist. Last thing that we have is this reusable brow mask, which I didn't know brow masks were a thing. I guess you put it above your eyebrows, so it's more of like on your forehead. Oh, so maybe it's supposed to like remove my wrinkles, my forehead wrinkles, which is would be nice because I do this a lot. And you can kind of see the lines, especially if I don't put my makeup inside the lines. You can see them. So maybe this will help me. Oh, here's the packaging. <gasps> Look at the packaging. That is so cute. Like that. Interesting. Okay, I want to try that out. I'm going to try that and the eye masks for sure. Now time to do my hair. I'm just going to touch up the curls. Um... Thank God my hair isn't too greasy today. It's so weird looking at myself with red hair. <laughs> I'm like not used to it. I'm using my little magic gloss mermaid hair clip because I feel like it's only fitting to only use like mermaid stuff today. It is me up on Tuesday, like with you in bed. Let me take you shopping. He said, Cash up for sale. She's a little big. I figure out how to fix these front pieces. I don't know how Gianna did it, but she made it look so like good. Maybe I need a straightener and like straighten them or something. I wish I was better at doing hair. Like that's like, like not my talent. I'm like sweating from doing my hair. I need to like take the sweatshirt off. And then I want to add the little starfish. So I'm thinking right there. And then maybe like one above and one below. Like maybe one here. Maybe I'll just do two. Like one big one and one little one. I'm taking photos. If you guys remember last summer, I came out with a clothing collection with Wild Rena. Wild Rena is a small business. They're based in the Bay Area. And the owner, her name is Brittany. Her boyfriend took all of the photos for us for that shoot. And he is being so kind and is helping me with this shoot today. I also kind of want to put together one more outfit. The sparkly dress is obviously like the main thing, but I want to take pictures of like my little aerial accessories and stuff. And so I kind of want to wear like maybe a purple tube top or something just to get us like a little bit more Little Mermaid content. Actually, let's call Lauren and see what she thinks I should do for my hair. Hello. Ooh, look at your eye look. I'm taking the mermaid pictures today. Can you help me out? No. And now, actually? Do you think two no. or three? Like Where that. would you put? I don't know. Or do you think that's uh, Or is it just too far? Not on the other side. Wait, put the third one there again. I think two. Two? Okay, I was thinking that too. Yeah. Perfect. Okay, love you. Yeah. Bye. Thank you. Perfect. Lauren said two. So we're doing two. Love that. You know how I said I went to Target. They needed black pillowcases, um, but I didn't vlog it. So when I had Cali Ariel bag clips, and if you follow me on TikTok, you know that I struggle with bad clips. I mean, even if you subscribe to my YouTube channel, you guys know that I struggle with like mystery unboxing, like pin unboxings and like all those things. I just have the worst luck. I bought five of them and hopefully we can get Ariel. I think my plan is 
Oh, I just realized there's like a ton. I probably should have bought like three more. There's Ariel, then we have a ton of sisters. We have Triton, we have Scuttle, Flounder, and Sebastian. Literally so many, so um, I don't know. I thought five would be enough because I was just looking at the front. And I was like, okay, like I feel like if I buy five, I have a pretty good chance of getting Ariel. But now seeing that there's two mystery ones, I didn't even check. Now I feel like I'm definitely screwing myself over here. But follow me on TikTok if you guys want to see what I end up getting in these. Picked up some lashes for today's shoot. So these are the lashes I found. These are House of Lashes in the style Good Karma. So we're gonna put these on, finish up this makeup look. And remember, okay. that was like two makeup. So we're, you know what we can do? Sure, okay. Finish sealing this one. Has Plan is to actually. This will open back up. Where are the lashes? I don't know if I love them or if they're like doing too much. It's so interesting because I used to be a hardcore lash girl. Like if you guys watch my vlogs even from last year or maybe the year before, I could not leave my house without wearing a pair of lashes. Now I'm like, I feel like I look so weird with lashes. Hopefully it grows on me in the next hour. <laughs> just spent um, like 15 minutes figuring out another outfit. What I came up with and I actually really love it. The top that I wore on the Disney cruise. I love it. It's from Urban Outfitters and I feel like it's the perfect summer top. And then this bralette I actually got at Target the other day and when I went and bought my bag clips and I didn't even think about using it for an outfit. I just really like the color of it. Like it's perfect. So we're doing this bralette and then I'm wearing these white cargo pants which are from Shein and then I'm accessorizing like how perfect is this bralette with the Stony Clover fanny pack so we're doing this Stony Clover fanny and then this is from Magic Gloss and then I added this little starfish that we didn't use we're gonna put it on here keychain is from Castle Crystals the same as the pop socket that's on my phone also gonna bring this as a prop this is from um, oh my gosh, it's like kind of scratching off. Impressions Vanity, and it's like a little mirror, and I love traveling with this. Also thinking my photos will be taken kind of like me brushing my hair. I got it on the Disney cruise, actually, but I believe you can get this at Target as well, so it's not really super special, but it does say Dingle Hopper, which is really cute. Now I'm just gonna pack up all my stuff, and then we're gonna head over to meet up with Brittany. We made it to our shoot location. Brittany is Yay. here. And we are at Alameda Beach, which is like by Oakland. And I've never been here before, but it's really low key and there's not many people here, which is really nice. It is cold though, um, so let's hope everything goes well. <laughs> Is she cold? No, no, no. <laughs> Not as cold as I'm talking to me. 